hello there how are you i am back with another update for all of you once again i hope that all of you are doing well and good in your life and everything's working out wonderfully so without wasting any of our time let's begin with our update and our read for today okay so this update is talking about a current challenge a lot of you are experiencing on your journey or um, might have in the past it is describing about a connection your counterpart has or had with a person in their life who looks like a friend a business partner or a coworker to me likely a male friend who not really is a friend in any way but the problem is that your counterpart thinks that this person is their friend whether it be a man or a woman doesn't really matter your person is totally fully devoted to this person your person trusts this person blindly at this point of time or is just unwilling to see this person's true colors because they've got dirt covered glasses on their own eyes at the, at this point of time so what you are getting advised here or informed about is that you need to give the situation to the divine forces and look away okay you cannot fix the situation i see that it's very likely that this man or this person is the cause or the reason behind the fallout you had with your counterpart this person did it or became the cause of it because your counterpart listens to this person or prioritizes this person more than anything at this point of time or more than needed that's the problem here okay so you're getting informed and uh, updated about the fact that the law change for good if they haven't witnessed this person's true colors just yet give the situation some time and space that's why you're getting advised to look away and focus on something else or something better other than the situation because you won't be able to fix it and if in any case you think about telling all of this to your counterpart don't make that mistake they'll block you out of their life or they are just going to pick up a fight with you or kick you out of their life in worst case scenarios because i see that those who did it ended up in a situation like that your person won't listen even a single word against this person or in his or her disrespect or dishonor even if it's truth okay they are not in that state of mind right now where they are looking for truth actually the problem here is that your person is the issue this other person is a deceptive person for sure this other person is a very sly cunning fox like individual who just uses people takes advantage of them and then betrays them like they mean nothing and that's what i see this person is either doing with your counterpart at the moment or is going to do which is actually going to wake them up and force them to open their eyes okay that's what i see you cannot do it don't even think about it don't even think of you know telling all of this to your counterpart or force them to see things clearly they won't they won't listen to you they don't care about any of that they won't care about any of that that's what i'm seeing here just leave or just detach yourself from all of this i feel like this person has caused you a lot of difficulty and trouble on your journey or is causing you because this person has a very negative and uh, terrible influence over your counterpart your counterpart just listens to this person very blindly trusts this person blindly follows this person blindly which is just leading them towards a very catastrophic outcome and actually they need it they need that outcome or that disruptive change or whatever is coming their way which doesn't look positive at all to wake them up and you know force them to smell 
the coffee or the roses or whatever it is let it all happen and just give it all away to god let them see this person's true colors on their own don't try to show it to them when they are not ready to they'll throw it all back onto you that's what i see here let destiny do the work you're not able to do right now let time expose this person in front of your counterpart because i see that they'll be very heartbroken when this happens or they are at this point of time if things have already changed here which i feel like have in many of your cases that's what i see i'm having little issues with my throat these days so just bear with me your counterpart is prioritizing or listening to this person at this point of time because they think that it's important to have a friend or a confidant or some someone like that when in reality this person is not deserving of being one in anyone's life this person cannot be a friend or a confidant can never become a person like that this person is just all about himself loves to rule or control or disrupt people's lives that's what this person likes to do this person doesn't care about anyone's life family or relationships this person cares about control and how this person can get away with whatever he or she wants allow things to change and unfold naturally is what i'm going to suggest to you all as i see that they are unfolding and uh, changing naturally and organically here in their own timing in their own perfect manner you might want to rush things up or uh, you might want to change things your way maybe to go your way but i don't feel like it's going to work out if you intervene or interfere in this matter as your person may end up saying some terrible nasty things to you for this person who isn't even deserving of having that place in anyone's life your person is giving to this person they definitely are going to get separated or you know thrown apart that's what i see here because of divine intervention or through way of divine intervention happening sooner or later so make sure that you just hold on to your anger if this person makes you angry or upset i feel like you saw this person's true colors or you just intuitively felt that there was something negative very very negative and uh, deceptive about this person that's why you never felt good about this person or around his or her presence and that's why i feel like you may have tried to warn your person about this this partnership this friendship or this association or whatever actually your person has got a terrible way of looking things looking at things i'm sorry they fear being alone the problem is that they fear facing their own insecurities their own fears and doubts and dilemmas that's why they surround themselves with people mindlessly they think that it's required and on top of that another problem is they associate themselves with terrible people as they make it easy for them these people won't challenge them to look within themselves or you know work on themselves do something about the issues or the problems they've got a right person would do so a right person would challenge them show them the right path guide them to you know heal themselves or fix what needs to get fixed like you might have done but the problem here is that your counterpart wants to have a easy life or get things done in a easy manner they do not want to deal with anything difficult or arduous or challenging they want everything to happen in a very easy smooth manner that's why it's all happening that's why they surround themselves with wrong people because wrong people know that it is a weakness it is a wonderful way of extracting whatever you want to extract from a person please them and just justify whatever they have to say that's what i feel like these people do with your counterpart or this one person does which is just making things worse or made things worse between the two of you however i see a beautiful change coming in here so you do not have to worry about that as this other person is not devoted to your counterpart as much as your person is so soon or later this person is going to show his or her true colors and who he or she is in many of your cases it's a man so i'm going to say he 
take it how it resonates if it's a she in your case just let go of the situation don't worry about your person at all and don't um, take things personally let them get their heart broken by this person let them have a taste of this betrayal and this hardship they are attracting in their life let them lose whatever they are meant to lose or are supposed to lose because of this person as i feel like this person is about to stab them in their back in a very unexpected manner this might have already happened or it's just about to happen which is going to force your person to move in another direction or just take a break maybe look within and think about changing for good as there's no other way for them to change the problem is your person here not the other people other people are just using your person's your counterparts flaws and defects or their inability to work on themselves unwillingness let's say not the inability they're unwilling to look within and fix their own issues because it's difficult and in some cases that's painful or is going to force them to isolate themselves go in reflection mode or retreat mode they don't want to do that because it brings their fears on surface doubts and dilemmas as well maybe they've got some horrible memories from the past they do not want to process through or get reminded of that's why they are just using these fake relationships maybe friendships associations or work connections as an excuse to just run away and avoid taking responsibility or accountability for the things which are going on in their life and need some fixing some working and changing i hope you're getting my point here right so be patient i mean that's all i have to say to all of you here there's no other way you'll have to force yourself to look the other way and just choose yourself in the end your counterpart is going to go through something terrible because of this person so just allow it all to happen and know that sooner or later they'll learn their lessons if they are calling for a disaster then that's what they need to wake up when god tried to make things easy for them by bringing you in their life they discarded it discarded you so they're bringing it all upon themselves let this person treat them in the worst of manner maybe they deserve it or need it for them to think about changing and doing something about their life or about your connection i see changes coming in here positive beneficial changes for you i see your person learning his or her lessons and doing something to fix the issues between the two of you or in their own life so sooner or later i see a good outcome for you sooner or later i see them choosing you and leaving this person out or just removing themselves from the picture if they won't then divine intervention is here to make sure that happens so allow it all to happen that's all i'm going to say to you pay heed to the guidance and the warnings i gave you in this reading don't try to take the matter in your hands don't try to separate them to by interfering in their connection it won't work you'll get separated and those who did it they know what i'm trying to say here and even if that happens take it as a blessing because i see that somehow it'll all work out in your favor as i see this person giving all the reasons to your counterpart to doubt this person become skeptical about this person or his or her intentions as they never really were pure clean or true they'll come out in the light sooner or later if it hasn't happened just yet trust god have faith in the divine plan even if it feels discouraging and depressing at the moments at the moment what else can you do right now other than just focusing on yourself and doing something positive and productive in your own life that's all you've got to do here okay so this was your update i'll be back sooner than later till then take care of yourself and your loved ones bye bye